Hey guys, tonight we're going to do blueberry muffins with a streusel top topping. So you're going to need 250 grams of self-raising flour, one teaspoon of bicarbonate of soda, one teaspoon of baking powder, one teaspoon of cinnamon, 100 grams of salted butter melted, 62 grams of golden syrup, 62 grams of honey, one teaspoon of vanilla, two large eggs, 150 grams of blueberries and that's just for the muffin itself and for the streusel topping you need 40 grams of plain flour and that's the bit we're going to mix up first so I'll pop it in 25 grams of light brown sugar yeah we'll pop that in Half a teaspoon of cinnamon, which you can see, is in with the flour, and then just 25 grams of salted butter. Make sure your oven is preheated to gas mark four, and all you're going to do is just gently rub together this little bit to make, with your fingertips to make the streusel topping. I don't know how successful that's going to be here because it is exceptionally hot tonight we'll give it a crack but you're just going to rub that together that streusel stopping and this will sit on top of your muffins just give it a different texture and a bit of a different flavour just sort of ramps up the blueberry muffins a little bit So once you've done that, which I have, for now, just set it to one side. Then you're going to want, let me just take them out, you're going to want your flour for your muffins, so that's 250 grams of self-raising flour, one teaspoon one better put it there, sorry, <laughs> of bicarbonate, one teaspoon of baking powder, one teaspoon of cinnamon powder into the bowl. So that's all your dry ingredients there. Good. Quick mix with your fingers. That's it. There we go. Set that aside. In another bowl, which I've just got to grab, so that's this one. In another bowl, you want to add, hang on just one second, guys. Hi. Hi, sorry about that guys, I missed out an ingredient. So in your muffin ingredients, you do need 150 ml of natural yogurt. So that was my bad, I do apologize. I will put the recipe down below for this one. So, I had to double check it then. 150 ml of natural yogurt. So, separate bowl you're going to put all your other remaining ingredients so we've got the yogurt the butter the honey and golden syrup Not wasting that. Look at all that goodness. Scrape it off. And then a, a teaspoon of vanilla. Make sure it's extract, please, guys. Really does make a difference. Oh. 
And then you want into this two eggs. What that is in my egg, but I don't want it. Deep it. Thank you. So we're now going to whisk these until combined. Then we're going to pour it into the flour mixture. And mix until it's just combined. So let's fold it through guys until it's just combined. This is a muffin mixture so it's not going to be loose. Swap for a spatula. And to this, all you're going to do now is add your 150 grams of blueberries. I have frozen, it doesn't make any difference either way. And fold those three. So, so, my muffin pan, I have some uncooperative muffin liners, so we'll have to just see how we can do with this. Fill your muffins, muffin liners, like you usually would. This should just make 12. So if you have any left over after you've been filling, in case you were worried you didn't have enough for them all, then just spread it between the others. I often hold back on how much I put in to start with, just in case it doesn't go around all of them. in there. So. Oh, I hate it when the cup when the liners are like that. They're such a pain in the bottom. Oh, I think I've gone a bit far on that one. Now we take a bit away. Don't forget you've also got to fit your streusel topping on onto this too. So we do have that little bit extra, so we're now going to just fit it in where we think one might be a bit too short on it. I can hear people already through the screen. That one there. 
<laughs> so that's the mixture in what we're going to do now grab a spoon and you have this small amount of streusel topping And that's all you're going to do. Just sprinkle it on top. It's got butter and sugar in this, guys, so with the heat in the oven, it is going to spread anyway. Again, I'm just trying to be a bit conservative so I get some on every one. I don't know how many times I've followed someone's recipe, you know. Oh, this makes 24 cupcakes. Yeah, I'm sat there looking at like 14. <laughs> so everyone has got some on. So I'm just going to do as I did before and scatter a bit on some that are lacking. And it's as easy as that guys apart from when somebody tells you that they've missed an ingredient but i will list it below so what you're going to do is place this into your preheated oven and you're going to bake for 25 to 30 minutes or until a skewer comes out of the middle of a muffin clean they're going to keep for about four days in an airtight container and they will go in the freezer. They freeze exceptionally well if you don't want to eat them all. Okay. So that's it. I'll show you what they look like when they come out. Hopefully they don't look like a complete not mess. <laughs> this is baking, guys. You just never know. All right, I'll see you at the end. Right, guys, so thanks for watching. This here is how they turned out. I hope you like it. I hope you give it a try. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.